Hey guys, it's Kem Kemmer. My name's Kem Van Case you're curious. Thank you for joining me for another video. And if you're new, then welcome. Today is my first empties video. So this is from January until I guess the end of March, because we're at the 29th right now. So three months worth of empties. Now it's not a lot, y'all, but for me, I am proud because I some of these products I've had for a while and I'm just like, I haven't used them until now. So we're just going to get into it. I'm just going to grab them at random. So the first thing I have is the main choice is Heavenly Halo Pre-Poo. I just did a video on this, I think like a month ago. And in that video, I actually finished the product. So I will link that one either in the description box or above. I feel like I'm going to run out of cards. So we'll just see. But this is definitely a repurchase. I love the way it made my hair felt after I applied it. It was very easy to detangle. I didn't even need to like saturate my hair with water, which is amazing. It caused less mess. Next is another main choice product. And it's the Exotic Kool-Aid Collection's Fresh Mango and Passion Fruit Mask. You guys, this mask. <laughs> I love everything mango and passion fruit. So like... It smells so, so, so good. And surprisingly, it took a lot more uses than I thought. It was a very, very thick mask. Um, It did moisturize my hair pretty well. It's not one of my favorites by any means. I probably won't repurchase it. um, Because, like, after a while, I just started using it as a pre-poo. Because I have so many deep conditioners that are, like, you know, they have slip. But they're not, like, they're not a favorite. So, yeah, that's where this is. I will not be repurchasing it. But... This is one of the best smelling products that Main Choice has made, in my opinion. Next is, well, I have a lot of pre poos in here. Um, so this is the Miel Moisture X Hawaiian Ginger Moisturizing Overnight Conditioner. Um, I think I only used this overnight once. <laughs> yeah, and I've never, I don't think I ever put this in a video. Um, I just kind of used it behind the scenes. it on my lip um it smells good it smells like hawaiian ginger i'm not really a ginger fan but it with with the little scents with the hawaiian scents i don't know what specifically it's supposed to be it smells really good um this one i also applied it to dry hair and it helped to tangle my hair super super well so will i repurchase probably not just because i have a lot of conditioners and i need to get through and this wasn't like a favorite, it was just okay. Next is, there's another main choice um, mask. It's the Do It For The Culture Untouchable Definition and Unmatched Volume Magnificent Miracle Mask. Another one that smells absolutely amazing. Definitely love the aesthetics for this line. It's gorgeous, it smells really good. It works really well. Um, this has great slip. The only problem is like I always add a, a, like a ton of product and it turns the water black. <laughs> like everything just turns black. So like I had to like wipe my tub up when I finished using it. But besides that, it's really good. I probably won't repurchase. It's just not one of my favorites. It is really good though. Um, and I have videos using all of these products so far except for this one. So I will link those. Um, next is the As I Am Restore and Repair Jamaican Black Castor Oil Co-Wash. This is a good one, y'all. This is a good one. It doesn't smell as good as the coconut co-wash, but it is really good. Like this is, it gives me more like creamier vibes. Like it doesn't set up as much as the coconut co-wash does. And it doesn't, oh my gosh, it does not really smell that great. <laughs> but I really really like this um I might actually repurchase this because like Sally's has sales a lot and so does Target so like if they have this on sale one day I might just pick it up because I'm um, a product junkie you say but yeah um actually I don't think I have a video using this either anyway next I have the Silk Elements Pure oils avocado oil um 
I just use this like I've realized avocado is like definitely fatty so like I felt more moisture on my hair when I use this I like to use it on my scalp because it's it like stopped the itching I guess maybe it was itching because it was dry and this helped with that so I mean avocado oil is kind of lit y'all don't have a video using that <laughs> I have next the nature's little secret fenugreek detangling pre-poo y'all I love this stuff now it's runny and messy yes and it smells like mints I have a video using this um I will link that but y'all like this product is so good will I repurchase absolutely I think this so far has been my favorite poop pre-poo to date if y'all can find something better than this let me know i've already tried the african pride one i like this better <laughs> that was years ago though but yes definitely a repurchase next is the shea moisture purple rice water strength and color care mask um this smells floral don't really like floral scents I actually mentioned this in my video during Curly Miss. It was the videos that I'm not taking with me to 2021. Um, literally, I did not use this as a deep conditioner after that video. I think I had one or two uses left. And I literally just use it as a pre-poo because I'm trying to get rid of it. It's, I definitely will not be repurchasing this or anything else from that line because I do not like this scent. Okay. Next, I have the Infamous Oil from... My family friend Judith, I mentioned this during Curly Miss as well. Um, it smells really, really good. I don't know what's in it. I don't know if it made my hair grow. I didn't really, I need to start, you know, tracking that kind of thing. Like when I try something new, I need to like track how well it works, how much my hair grows, how thick it gets, that kind of thing, um, which I plan to do soon. Stay tuned, stay tuned. But yes, this smells amazing. It definitely helped with itching like when i use oils it's usually to help alleviate itching in my scalp so this definitely did that and it smells really really good my boyfriend also has i bought him one for um christmas and he loves to use it for his hair and his beard too so um i can put judith's information in my description box next okay so <laughs> i had to write this one down because it was like in the packet anyway it's the Na nature all's club curl defining deep conditioner the ice cream one that i tried in a video um i think over the summer um i actually used this one up as a pre-poo too because i really really like it's very natural scented and if you guys can't tell i'm into like the main choice like nature's little secret Mish. like i like products that smell like candy that's what i want that's what i want in my life either candy or like fruits and this smelled like earth <laughs> so it was a really good deep conditioner i use yeah like i said i use it as a pre-poo afterwards because um i didn't really have enough to like fully get a full deep condition so i used most of it i mean i used it up and then i think i used like another one of these afterwards to finish my hair but I will not repurchase. I'm pretty sure they're kind of expensive and I always forget about them because they're in the freezer. Plus I have a new favorite refrigerated product. If y'all have not seen my video using Eco Slay, definitely check that out. Oh my gosh, the products are falling. It almost hit me. Okay, um, next, Sultanical. I actually have a video of this too. I can post that above. That's also during Curly Miss. I actually got two uses out of this. So, I don't know. But I absolutely love this product. It was even better the second time around because I actually let it sit in my hair longer. And when I tell you my hair was so clean and so, so, so moisturized and defined after I rinsed this out, you guys... This stuff is amazing. Yes, it's dirty. It's like, it's it's a very messy product, but I love it. Did I even tell y'all what it was? It's the Master Hair Cleanse Curl Detox. <laughs> Pretty much anything from Sultanicals, I'm ready just to snag up, except for I'm going to have to hold off on that rice water stuff. I'm just going to use what I have and probably not repurchase, but 
repurchase everything else. Everything else that I finished from Sultanicals will most definitely be a repurchase. And my final product is one I actually finished yesterday and it's from Naturally Azalea and it's their Herbal Scalp and Hair Hair Growth Serum. I actually won this product um, in one of her giveaways. So you guys, this brand, stay tuned because this the next video is going to be an unboxing So next video you guys see will be me unboxing all these products that I got. Obviously I use this one up. I love this. It has rosemary like specks in it and like it smells really good. It works really well. I use it whenever my scalp itches because as you can see my scalp itches a lot. I don't know. I don't know why. I use shampoo. Like I don't only co-wash. I promise I use shampoo but <laughs> my scalp just itches a lot. So I use this and it also promotes hair growth. So when I you start using these products, you guys, I'm gonna start I'm gonna start doing the the length checks and stuff because I'm excited. So excited and so grateful to be part of this brand right now, you guys. Whew. But um, I actually have a code, so if you guys would like to check out this oil, I will leave that in the description box. But if you want to stay tuned and wait to see what else I got from them, I, I completely understand, sis. But this is bomb. It makes my scalp feel so, so good. Like, as soon as I put it on, like, some oils you just put it on, it's like, okay. This one you put it on, it's like, oof. Oof. Love this stuff. But yes, that is all I have for my empties today, you guys. I did pretty good if you ask me. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve products that I finished between January and March. So I think I'm probably gonna do these seasonally. I'm trying to use up more products even while I'm trying new ones. So like you as you saw, like a lot of these deep conditioners I didn't love, so I use them as pre-poos, and that's how I end up using them up. But, you know, a win is a win in my book. So I'm going to recycle this, all these things, and then I'm going to fill it back up for you guys in the next couple months for my spring empties. So, let me stop. So that's all I have for you guys. So make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend, tell a cousin to tell a cousin. Follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description box. And check out my Naturally Azalea link. And... Yeah, also just make sure you subscribe. Yeah, I know I said that twice, so make sure you subscribe because I got some fun things coming for you guys. I have some fun things coming in these next couple of months. So definitely be be in and locked in, ready to go. Turn on the no notification bell. That's a new one. I've never said that. Turn on the notification bell. Yeah, I think that's it. Bye, guys.